Hello, YouTube. Rick Vera checking in from Briarville Repair and Restoration Shop at Joe Case Pipes. Wanted to come out and say hey today. Got something to show you, but before we get started uh, with that, let's uh, check in with the traditional housekeeping. What a shock! My Eric Nording freehand, probably the most featured pipe on the Briarville Video Tube Network, because <laughs> I smoke it every day. I know. All right, I know you purists are jumping out of your seat. Hey, you're not supposed to do that. <laughs> Hell, tough. I'm doing it. It's my hobby. I'll do it my way. Besides, I can work on them and keep them fresh when I choose to. <laughs> and this one needs some work and some keeping fresh. I promise. <laughs> Actually... <laughs> I bit through the stem. Oh my. Anybody know where I can get that fixed? <laughs> Just like the mechanic's car, man. It's always the last to be worked on. <laughs> I want to thank you guys for keeping me busy enough that I don't have time to work on my own darn pipes. inside my Eric Nording freehand with the chewed up stem. I've got some gaslight, JLP's gaslight, and for you fans of the English blends, this stuff is fabulous. I love it. I picked it up online at one of the online retailers. And I'll do the commercial for you just to convince you to go out and buy it. Here it is, a rich, let me see, can you see that? Do this, all right, here we go. There you go, you see it? That's all right. A rich Latakia uh, mixture pressed into one ounce cakes on a misty, moonless night along huh, twisted, <laughs> Cobblestone lanes illuminated only by the glow of an ancient iron lantern. You follow a scent as dark as the night itself. The exotic fragrant, fragrance, hauntingly familiar, compelling, and irresistible. Mmm. Just makes you want to go right out and order you up some, doesn't it? <laughs> well, if it doesn't, it should, because I'm telling you, it's good stuff. I think they'll hire me over to JLPs. Let me show you what it looks like. Comes in a tin, and it's obviously it's got the uh, internal uh, packaging. I can't show you the cakes because I've already crumbled it up, and uh, and there's not even anything left in there. But the reason why I crumble it up is because it's so easy. It, it just it's it, it just absolutely uh, it crumbles in your fingers and into a very nice flake, and it uh, it packs into the tobacco chamber just very nice. Stays lit. Uh, you don't need to cram it down. You just basically just let it set in there and uh, fire it up, and it does a uh, fabulous job. I mean, for English blends. For you guys that like the English blends and you haven't tried the uh, JLPs, give it a shot. You'll like it. It's good stuff. And that's about the extent of my tobacco reviews. Yeah, it's good or no, that sucks. But this stuff is good. So I highly recommend it. Take a swig of my Folgers. As you know, I don't do much of that sissy Starbucks stuff. My Folgers. Mmm. In my Sutliff mug. Sutliff. I just did a JLP's commercial. Now I'm confused. 
Sutliff's working really hard though to get your business, so try them out as well. All right. Now, a real reason we started this nonsense is I got a great deal that I want to pass on to you guys. Um, uh, so this is to the uh, Peterson fans out there. So let's talk Peterson's just a uh, just a little while. Back in 1987, Peterson came out with a collector series called the Sherlock Holmes and what a uh, Sherlock Holmes series. And what it was, it was a uh, uh, a collection of seven pipes in in its own dedicated stand, and uh, they sold as a set. And they were kind of pricey. It was like for the seven, I think right around fifteen hundred, two grand somewhere in there, but. Uh, but it uh, it was very popular, uh, so popular that in the 90s they did another Sherlock Holmes uh, collection. Only they called it uh, Junior Sherlock Holmes Junior. Same seven pipes, only slightly smaller. When I say slightly smaller, uh, uh, I mean slightly smaller. Here is a Peterson. Sherlock Holmes Jr. And this is a gorgeous bulldog. Um, and and you can see it's not a, a dainty pipe at all when compared to my uh, my Nording. Uh, it's uh, I mean it's a it's a it's a it's a substantial pipe. So I, I don't but they were slightly smaller, so they called it a junior. They have all the same uh, quality as the the original uh, offering. They all came with a uh, sterling silver band with uh, Sherlock uh, stamped into the uh, into the band. I don't know if you, if the video is going to pick that up, but uh, the Sherlock Holmes likeness is uh, is stamped into the band along with the uh, three boxes uh, indicating uh, it is sterling silver. Inside the stem, uh, or rather inlaid into the stem, is a uh, silver P. This isn't a, uh, a white plastic uh, 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 inlay. It's, uh, it's a silver inlay. And on the uh, on this particular pipe, on the uh, uh, on the Briarville scale, uh, one to four, four being new, this has been rated as a three and which is near new and as you can tell it is near new the only reason why it got a three is one because it's not brand new and two there is a slight discoloring on the rim that i didn't want to take down to where i was going to have to refurbish the entire rim it's uh, the the discoloring is so slight you're probably not even going to see it on the video uh it's it's right about there uh going back to the stem it's flawless there's nothing wrong with that stem at all it's uh it it is absolutely like new it's uh the uh traditional uh, original uh p-lip and the uh the tobacco chamber has been uh, reamed out and uh, recoated it's it's ready to go the whole thing obviously has been sanitized and uh, uh, it's ready to smoke as soon as you get it now this is on my website but I don't want you guys if you're interested in this to go to the website and and purchase it uh, you have to pay shipping there but as a uh, bonus for uh, the subscribers of this channel uh, I'm going to cover the uh, the shipping on it so if you uh, if you're interested in this pipe and it's this is a highly collectible pipe uh, or if you're collecting juniors or if you want to get started with uh, with uh, 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 a new collection this would be a great one to do it with this one is modeled after the uh, deer stalker in the original collection uh, which as you can tell is a bulldog the the lines are solid in there absolutely nothing wrong with that at all um, 
and I went ahead and refurbished this to back to a like new condition and it is ready for you right now ready to ship if uh, if you're wanting it we got a good deal on it uh, basically I'm covering my costs at uh, my cost to uh, for the refurb work so I'm only asking 180 for this pipe uh, and when you uh, go out there and do your due diligence to find out what these are actually going for, you're going to find they're between 220, 250, somewhere in there. And this is definitely one worth picking up if that will fit into your collection. So that's about it. Uh, thanks so much for watching and thanks so much for the business. Uh, while you're out, checking it out I've got some other other pictures on the uh, the, the website um, uh, but there it is again go ahead and uh, have a look but don't don't if you're if you're planning on purchasing this pipe which I've only got the one um, uh, just contact me at Rick at joecasepipes.com and uh and and i'll cover the shipping for you on that um so something else i was wanting to tell you but hey, i'm an old guy and i forgot what it was <laughs> do this though we started uh messing around with twitter a little bit um and uh, that's at briarville and uh been taking some progress shots of uh, different projects and, and posting them out there and and people have been uh, 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 following uh, following the uh, the progress out there on Twitter so if you want to see some stuff and some inner workings of the shop go ahead and uh, do it out there we don't blow it up or anything but occasionally when something's cool we'll uh, we'll, we'll take a shot and throw it out there but that's pretty much all I've got today. Thanks so much for watching. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet. Uh, like us out at uh, facebook.com slash Briarville, and we'll talk to you later. I'm Rick from Briarville, repair and restoration shop at Joe Case Pipes, saying peace out.